Okay, ready to go live. Ready? All right. How are we doing, guys? My name is Logan. Uh, behind me, I've got my brother here, Sam. He's uh, helping us out with all the technical stuff. So glad to have have him here. And then uh, the other Sam, my friend Sam. Um, who you've also seen on the channel, he will hopefully be joining us uh, possibly a little bit later. So what is going on? Looks like we got a couple people, JP Lons, Odin, um, no, did I, let's see, uh, K. Wynn, and um, Ottawa's Freelance Photography. How you guys doing? Um, so Ryobi has 25 plus is the announcement, 25 plus new tools hopefully we're going to be able to stream this uh and actually show what they're seeing i don't know if uh how how that'll all work out we've uh, not done this before so bear with us as we uh we try and make this happen but uh in little less than 10 minutes we should have uh have hopefully some new new products to talk about so before they start, um, comment. Let us know what you guys want to see. I know we've we've talked about a few things uh, in our one of our last videos. We talked about this this announcement and the new tools, vacuums and lights, and um, there's a whole bunch of cool ideas that you guys had. Um, tell us tell us what you think. Comment below. Let us know or comment in the chat and let us know uh, the. Um, what do you think it's going to be? So I don't know if they're actually going to be on YouTube. Somebody was asking, where's their their stream? I think it's only on their website. I think they're only streaming on their website. So as you can see, we have the ryobitools.com site up. Uh, it should be showing where we're at. So um, yeah, I think I think that's where they're they're going to be streaming it. So we'll see if it lets us continue to stream their stream. And if it does, we'll uh, we'll stay with you. If not, then we'll talk through it while they stream it, and we'll talk about some of the new stuff that they've got going on. And uh, worst case scenario, if that doesn't even work, check back tomorrow because for sure we'll have a video talking about all the all the cool new stuff. Hybrid tools, uh, Brian says yes. Please more hybrid tools. Absolutely. They never sent the link. Yeah, it, uh, it it came in an email. So if you signed up, um, they should have emailed you the link to actually go go watch it. Um, let's see. And maybe maybe there was a limited number. We'll see. An electric bike. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 40 volt. Put a couple of 40 volts on a, uh, an electric bike. Be a nice, nice conversion. So yeah, most of this we're, we're going to be hanging out. If you've watched the Ryobi, uh, announcements before there, they do a lot of, a lot of talking in between the tools, uh, hopefully some demo, um, so definitely, uh, try and jump back and forth. We'll try and keep you updated as, uh, as we go through this stream. Um, we'll, we'll continue to repeat some of the tools that they've announced. And again, check back tomorrow for sure, because we'll, we'll do a video tonight and, uh, get it released for tomorrow. So you guys can see all the new stuff and hopefully, hopefully we get some, some cool stuff. I'm personally, I'm hoping HP, uh, Definitely hybrid tools. Let's let's see uh, let's see some new um, some new vacuums. Honestly, I know um, there was there was a whole bunch of things. You guys, the OnePlus scooter. Yeah, so that's another another reminder. It is um, they said OnePlus twenty five OnePlus uh, tools. So maybe some forty volts. Um, but yeah, yeah. It sounds like mostly they're, they're one plus. 
watching from the UK, Patrick. Yeah. Yeah, I, I wish we could get some of your guys' tools over here. You guys have some that we don't have. Uh, same with Australia. Have a have a couple that we don't have. So hopefully uh, we start seeing some of those cross the pond. A heater, a one plus heater. That'd be like a like a space heater. I think that would be probably suck a lot of power. Sean repairs. Watch from Canada. It's going, Sean. So Odin wants to know what tools. Uh, we wish they'd make or improve. Um, yeah, there's, <laughs> there's a, there's a lot. Um, honestly, I've, I've been really impressed with their 40 volt line. So as far as their 18 volt, um, tools that we'd like to see improved, there's, there's a whole bunch of features. Again, Ryobi's not, uh, not, not the bottom, but they're not the top either. So there's a lot of features that some of these higher end tools have that could be brought over. A lot of the, the drills, um, uh, the impacts, the, uh, the saws that we could see, see some, some real feature advancement or some advanced features coming to the, the one plus tools. So, um, specifically, um, Somebody had mentioned the one plus one, the, for example, the, um, miter saw, they have a one plus one miter saw that came out a few years ago. Uh, in fact, we actually gave one away. Um, and I would love to see them take, take more tools, uh, like that. The, the question is, you know, does that impede into the 40 volt? Uh, we, someone else had, had said that the 40 volts really more their lawn and garden, 18 volts more their, uh, you know, uh, power tools like, uh, saws and drills and stuff. So yeah, we'll, we'll see 40 volt power cleaner. Yeah, I know all the, all the 40 volts, uh, 18 volt propane heater. Yeah, that'd be, that'd be a good one. The handheld vacuum for sure. Yeah. We'd like to see, you know, the vac the vacuums like that. That's that's probably the biggest one personally. And I, I actually don't dislike um, their vacuums per se, but especially the three gallon, the three gallon uh, wet dry vac is is really nice. I personally, I really like that one. Um, the handheld vacs, I think the new um, the new stick vac is really nice. Um, we haven't got our hands on it, but they did, uh, they, they have improved that one since the, the older model that we have. And, uh, it looks, it looks like it's a lot better. So hopefully, uh, hopefully we see some improvement in the vax. Um, yeah, yeah, that'd be nice. Maybe, a, uh, somebody had said a backpack vacuum, but again, is that a 40 volt? Should that be a 40 volt? Well, we'll see. Yeah, the three gallon. So you're going to go for the three gallon vac, but uh, waiting for this launch. That's that's the question. Are they going to, you know, um, I've actually got some friends that that <laughs> messaged me uh, just just right around the time of the announcement. And I said, well, look, there's there's Ryobi has some awesome tools. But if you do want to get the latest and greatest, you know, and you can hold off till today possibly another month, depending on how long it takes them to actually get these in the stores or at least online. Um, you know, try and wait the right angle impact driver. Yeah. So the garage door, the garage door. Yes. Um, and I don't know the full story on it. I actually had, uh, I actually had mine recently. It wasn't the opener that had a problem, but the actual door itself had, a, had an issue. So I, I called a repair man to come and fix my door. 
And he had said that Ryobi had been sued and that there's a lawsuit. And I looked it up later and it looks looks like that's that is kind of what happened. There was some kind of suit that uh, that was filed against Ryobi. Um, I love hate the garage doors. I that there's so much potential. I feel like there um, the, the potential is, is so much that it it I, I haven't replaced them yet. That, that was originally one thing. I have both the garage doors. I've got the the two horsepower and then the one and a quarter horsepower i think um and there's room for improvement for sure and the app uh was mentioned the app uh, needs to be improved or that the camera app for sure needs to be improved but um yeah it's i would love to see him bring back the garage doors uh, everyone that that i show the garage door openers and the modules to are really impressed again it's not something I'd probably get for like my mom. Um, that's not technically savvy and able to actually, you know, uh, fix it when there's a problem. But, uh, yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully they're able to bring that back. So looks like we are going live. Uh, let's see. to share some exclusive details on a new Ryobi products and some cutting edge innovation coming to your home, your job site, or your garage very soon. Thanks so much for joining us. My name is Chip Wade. I've been in the construction industry for years and I've seen that. firsthand new products, new innovation, and entire industry shifts the in the through? world of tools. I don't know if the audio is Leading going that through. charge is Ryobi, who is consistently yeah, focused here. on new product Starting innovation the... and creating solutions for their customers. Ryobi is dedicated to empowering homeowners to DIY and yep. equipping pros with quality products they can afford, all while providing incredible value to the customer. Consistently expanding their platform of tools, Ryobi offers solutions to any user, all while leaving no customer so behind. Like I said, guys, what um, that means kind of is that our tools here, and, and batteries are backwards stuff. compatible, um, allowing will, you to I'm pick sure up a battery today video, and uh, use it on, their, on a tool their that later. you purchased years um, ago. This, this kind of Along intro with system stuff compatibility, they're gonna, they're gonna go Ryobi has all continued the cool to innovate and done. update their existing so, batteries and cool. tools with the but, latest uh, cutting edge we'll, we'll tech, answer, all while expanding into new categories and, and giving our customers the power to do more. 12 amp battery, Ryobi yeah. is an exclusive partner with the Home audio Depot, is the number one home improvement retailer audio. in the entire world. And this year marks the 25th anniversary of the OnePlus platform with the Home Depot. Since then, the Ryobi OnePlus platform has now grown to over 225 tools. In addition to the OnePlus platform so the high, growth, the, the Ryobi has made leaps and bounds, expanding into that? other categories like automotive, yeah, turn it down. lifestyle, Sweet. and outdoor. Thanks, guys, for your comments. I uh, really appreciate you guys being patient with us as we try and uh, work all this out. It's exciting. I'm, I'm, I'm so... Now, let's see want what the new Ryobi tool. Let's see them. store for us. Continuing their dedication to the customer by providing best-in-class products at the best value. So real quick, anybody that's used Ryobi tools back in the blue and yellow orange days, comment below. Let, let me know uh, who's who's been using the, the tools for a long, long time. This guy. Welcome back. Now joining us, we have Brian Myrtle, Vice President of Product Management for Ryobi Power Tools. Now, Brian, tell us a little bit about some of those new products we just saw and what else is in store. Thanks, Chip. And I am honored to be here as we unveil an array of new tools and accessories from Ryobi. As you mentioned, we now have over 225 OnePlus tools in our lineup. That's more than four times our closest competitor. <laughs> that is really incredible, Brian. So how did Ryobi come to get here with so over I'm, 225 tools? I'm not seeing a whole lot well, like of said, uh, new, new stuff. stuff. In fact, in that video, it was showing a lot of the old and tools. So let's, from the very beginning. let's see uh, so why is that let's see what they end up well, as our showing us here, guys. On, we're unwilling to alienate any of our customers who have invested in our platform. Our OnePlus customer base is very broad, ranging from the first-time tool owner to the pro looking for a great tool at a great price. This commitment to our OnePlus platform 
provides all our customers with confidence that they can continue to add onto their system over time. Now you may recall that last year we launched over 30 OnePlus HP brushless tools that have been a runaway success. And as we said, we were not stopping there. As we unveil over 25 additional OnePlus The track tools. saw, yeah, I did right, see, I think there's tools. a track saw. The launch in December. Rated that had uh, crazy. Now, commented. Now I definitely used a lot of the HP OnePlus tools. I must say it's impressive. They're lightweight, but they're incredibly sturdy. They're very strong. It's an impressive set of tools, I gotta say. Well, it's the combination of brushless motors, advanced technology, and high performance lithium ion batteries simply make these the best performing tools we've ever made. The feedback that we've received from both our DIY and our pro customers have been overwhelming. And the additional product request to supplement this line has been incredible. Now, Chip, you, you may bring also the video up just a hair. We launched all these tools last year. We said that was just the beginning. What you're going to see here today is an expansion of our HP brushless lineup, continued improvement of our core line of tools, while also expanding into many new categories each year, one of them being automotive. With that, let us see what Nick has for us in the automotive solutions category. Take it away, Nick. Good afternoon, everyone. As Brian mentioned, today we're going to be talking about our expanding Ryobi automotive lineup. Over the last year, Ryobi has reached new heights in the automotive segment with the launch of great solutions like the OnePlus Dual Action Polisher, the OnePlus Cordless Ratchets, the OnePlus HP Compact Brushless 4-Mode 3 8 inch Impact Wrench, and the OnePlus HP Brushless 4-Mode half inch Impact Wrench. At Ryobi, our commitment to the end user means that we're out in the field seeking ways to deliver solutions and accelerate job site tasks while maintaining compatibility, capability, and delivering innovation at an incredible value. Today, we're proud to announce the expansion of our automotive tool segment with the introduction of several tools, including the OnePlus Detail Polisher, the OnePlus HP Brushless quarter inch and 3 8 inch extended reach ratchets, extended the OnePlus reach. HP Compact Brushless right angle die grinder. In addition, we've expanded our impact mm, range grinder. to offer even more power with the OnePlus HP Brushless 4 mode half inch high torque impact wrench. So let's dive into it and discuss exactly how these tools will revolutionize the way you get work done. Yep, At this point, you've seen wrench, the incredible nice. results that the OnePlus Dual Action Polisher delivers. But for users looking for a more compact polishing solution, this 3-inch polisher and sander is ideal for headlight restoration, trim detailing, and work in tight spaces. Again, the compact lightweight design of this tool makes it ideal for use in tight spaces like working on motorcycle fairings, louvers, and bumpers. And the cordless versatility of the tool means that no compressors, air hoses, or cords are needed. This tool offers up to 60 minutes of runtime on one battery charge. This tool is going to feature a two-speed switch for both polishing and sanding applications, as well as a variable speed trigger for detailed yeah, work. Yeah, tons and tons of garage box, tools, it looks like. It looks like this pads, is, uh, could, have, could have been titled a garage discs, two tool, inch backer pad, 25 tool release. <laughs> Next, we have a Ryobi OnePlus HP Compact Brushless Right Angle Die Grinder. Working with our users in the field have allowed us to deliver a compact, powerful solution that is a first to the Ryobi OnePlus lineup. This right angle die grinder will deliver on three key aspects for the end user. Powerful performance for tough cutting and grinding applications, maximum control, and reduced downtime. With up to two times more power than pneumatic, you can expect more power and runtime from HP technology, comprised of brushless motors, advanced electronics, and high performance batteries. This added power and performance means that tasks can be completed more efficiently without the need for compressors, hoses, or the daily maintenance that a traditional pneumatic die grinder demands. Control is a key element of performance and execution of a fine finish result. This die grinder has two features that deliver on control. First, dial into your target speed using the four mode speed control on the foot of the tool. The four mode speed control offers control of 10,000 to 22,000 rotations per minute for a wide range of compatible accessories. And second, the paddle trigger offers an experience consistent with traditional pneumatic die grinders, offering power from the tool on demand. Spend less time changing accessories and increase productivity. So big focus on getting rid of log. your uh, pneumatics. It looks like this is uh, converting everything from pneumatic to, so gone to battery. So the days of having to use two wrenches and a vise just to change the bit, saving valuable time on the job. We know how important accessibility is when you're working in the tight spaces of a vehicle, but forward and backward compatibility has always been of the utmost importance to us. When we launched the cordless ratchets in 2020, we brought an innovative approach to blending these two requirements by offering a four position rotating head that allows you to rotate the OnePlus battery and reintroduce accessibility on the familiar 18 volt platform. Today, we're announcing two additions to the OnePlus HP lineup with the quarter inch and three eighths inch extended reach ratchets. 
These tools blend OnePlus HP technology and the innovative features of our original Extended ratchets reach. to bring a more powerful, it. more nice. capable tool. This ratchet brings accessibility to the next level with an extended reach neck design and slim four position rotating head. Not only can you access more fasteners than ever before, but you can break them free more easily. With the power of this ratchet, you can take it out of the garage and accelerate installation and assembly projects around the house and on the job site, making it one of the most versatile tools that Ryobi has to offer. The OnePlus HP technology delivers more power under load with up to 55 foot-pounds of torque on the 3 8 inch version and 40 foot-pounds of torque on the quarter inch version. With dual LEDs, you'll be able to see the job at hand more clearly in any head position, and both ratchets feature an ergonomic metal paddle trigger that offers full control of up to 230 rotations per minute on the 3 8 inch version and 260 rotations per minute on the quarter inch version. This speed will accelerate a traditionally manual task, cutting down on time and improving efficiency. As I mentioned earlier, we're constantly working with and listening to our customers every day. We know that you've been asking for an impact wrench that delivers a thousand foot pounds of Thank torque. You. And the Thank OnePlus you. HP Brushless 4 mode half inch high torque impact wrench delivers it. With the power to accomplish nearly every job you throw at it, this impact wrench will power through applications like removing the most stubborn crank Here's bolts, the impact wrench we've all been asking for. Nuts and track bar mounts. Not only that, but when you compare this to some of the options on the job site, this tool will establish itself as a go-to for driving the largest fasteners, saving time and getting every job done faster than ever before. Beyond the incredible performance of this tool, we have paired this high torque impact wrench with features that will enhance convenience, productivity, and durability. The foundation of the OnePlus HP Brushless 4 mode half inch high torque impact wrench is OnePlus HP technology, which will deliver more power, faster removal speeds, and extended tool life and runtime. The die cast gear casing will stand up to the test of the trade. The tri beam LEDs will not only shine brighter in every environment, but will also help to overcome socket shadows. And when talking about convenience, we've paired this tool with a friction ring that allows for secure socket retention, but won't require an interruption when moving between jobs. To expand on convenience, one of the staples of the HP lineup is technology. We've paired this tool with a four mode speed control, including auto mode. You've seen auto mode before on our compact and mid-torque HP impact yep. wrenches, and it remains on this high torque impact Four wrench. mode, nice. Once again, it will prevent over-tightening and allow for smooth controlled removal in reverse as it will detect when the fastener is broken free and help avoid drop fasteners. Whether you're a diesel mechanic, iron worker, plumber, contractor, or DIYer, the Ryobi OnePlus HP Brushless 4 mode half-inch high torque impact wrench is the ideal solution to complement your arsenal. Each one of these new OnePlus tools will be available in stores and online exclusively at the Home Depot and homedepot.com in various tool only and kit configurations. So that wraps up our automotive segment. Back to you. Ryobi has really nice. raised not, the not all the automotive. automotive. <laughs> and they're keeping up that same oh, momentum oh, in many tell me that's other a nail at the top. Let's switch gears and talk about some of the carpentry solutions that Ryobi is introducing on top of their extensive frame line of nailer, tools. Framing nailer, framing nailer. options for the pro, Ryobi has really stepped up their game, providing best-in-class solutions for the job site at an unbeatable value. Let's see what Kelly has to show us. Thanks, Chip. Now that you've heard how we're expanding upon our automotive tool selection, I wanted to highlight the existing systems that we're constantly approving and updating. Here at Ryobi, we provide solutions for the homeowner and DIY customer, as well as the value pro on the job site. Along these solutions, we're revamping our 18-volt OnePlus Airstrike nailer lineup, as well as introducing a OnePlus flooring saw and OnePlus miter saw. To kick things off, we have the 18-volt OnePlus flooring saw that's going to feature a rip cut capacity of 8 inches wide, ideal for your LVT and hardwood flooring. It can cut up to 240 linear feet of LVT and has a blade optimized for fast, clean cuts so you can get the flooring laid down and cut much quicker. It also features onboard storage for your accessories as well as a carrying handle so you have extreme portability and user convenience. Next is our 18 volt one plus seven and a quarter sliding miter saw. This delivers 3,600 RPMs as well as best in class two by 10 cross cut capacity. This saw can deliver up to 800 cuts per charge and has a one and a quarter inch dust port to keep your workspace. So this is a nice one. I, I still like the one plus one. The included 42 carbide tip blade maximizes performance sliding for a clean saw cut better, every time. But seven and a quarter Moving on from cutting on the job site, we're also introducing some new additions to the 18 volt one plus airstrike family of nailers. Our new Ryobi 18 volt one plus 18 gauge brad nailer is the industry's most compact and lightest 18 volt brad nailer and is also 12% more compact than the previous model. This brad nailer features a 45% smaller nose than the previous model for tight spot access and has an LED light for better visibility in tight spaces. 
The improved depth of drive and pressure adjustments allow for improved accuracy when driving 5 8 inch to 2 inch brad nails. Driving up to 1900 nails per charge with an 18 volt 4 amp hour battery, you can tackle any job at hand. Alongside the one plus 18 gauge brad nailer, we have the one plus 18 gauge narrow crown stapler. This new model leads the market in size to weight ratio and is 7% more compact than the previous model. The OnePlus Narrow Crown Stapler features improved depth of drive and pressure adjustment dials for a 30% faster adjustment and drives up to 1,700 nails per charge with an 18 volt 4 amp hour battery. Finally, we have the Ryobi 18 volt OnePlus 16 gauge straight finish nailer. This nailer features a more powerful motor than the previous model for a reliable drive every time. It also has improved line of sight and 78% smaller nose for improved access. The tool-free depth of drive and pressure adjustments on this nailer have been optimized for faster adjustments and increased user efficiency on the job site. Lastly, this nailer drives up to 1,000 nails per charge with an 18 volt 4 amp hour battery and accepts 3 quarter inch to 2 and a half inch 16 gauge straight finish nails. Each one of these OnePlus tools will be available in so the stores and online good. exclusively at Not the Home Depot and various the kit configurations that I was and tool only for. options. Now Dang back it. to you, Chip. Ryobi continues was to innovate good, and provide solutions for the for, OnePlus customers more there. that are ideal at home or on the job site, delivering top quality products at an incredible value. Again, our 18 volt OnePlus battery works with over 225 tools, making Ryobi an ideal choice for any homeowner. Diving into some new tools that are perfect to add to your home collection, we're going to look at some of the new hobby and craft additions, as well as some lifestyle and outdoor products to round out your garage. Hey, Lindsay, what have you got in store for us? Thanks, Chip. Yeah, now let's no check out some nailer. of our new and current hobby and craft solutions. As a growing category, Ryobi has seen a surge in demand from our users in the hobby and craft space. Ryobi has continued to expand within this category with introductions like our 18 volt one plus precision rotary tool and our 18 volt one plus compact glue gun. In the last year, Ryobi has seen users <laughs> take fan. on more home and hobby projects yeah, there's some, than there's ever some drama before, going around and Ryobi gives fans. you the power to do more on one battery platform. Our newest addition to the hobby and craft category is the 18 volt one plus dual temperature glue gun. Users have raved about our original 18 volt one awesome. plus glue gun. Awesome, and we got so uh, took everything you loved Sam and is made it in. Dual How's temperature going, settings Sam? increase versatility and allow you to handle more projects than ever before. Low temperature setting allows use on heat sensitive materials with lower temperatures at a maximum of 240 degrees Fahrenheit. The high temperature delivers the same exact performance as our original 18 volt one plus glue gun with rapid adhesive delivery Sorry, at a maximum mute. temperature of What's 320 up, degrees Fahrenheit. You're good, man. This tool features an LED indicator that not only tells you when the tool is on, but it's ready for use. And the onboard fold-out tray up, catches guys? any stray glue, helping you keep a clean workspace. This tool includes 10 full-size glue sticks and two additional nozzles for various applications, making this the most versatile cordless <laughs> glue gun in our current lineup. This glue gun is available exclusively on HomeDepot.com in various so, kit configurations and tool-only options. I didn't want to see a glue gun release. Tool, um, Ryobi I actually also really has many like lifestyle now, tools now that I have ideal a for the homeowner, DIY gun, customer, I'll never and go outdoor back enthusiast. To a, a hot glue I'm going to pass things over to Grayson, who's going to talk so, you through those, those are cool. our lifestyle tools tool, on the Ryobi cool. OnePlus gun, platform. But hey, everyone. I'm uh, here today to talk to you about some exciting new Ryobi OnePlus products in our lifestyle category. But before we get started talking to you about our new plus solutions, I want to yeah, talk to you about dumb not literally the cord, coolest new product we have in our lineup. Awesome. The new Ryobi OnePlus 4-inch clamping fan. With no cord. Our traditional Here's the Ryobi drama. Here's fan the clamp has been a staple drama. in the OnePlus Apparently, lineup since literally going on the like beginning. Buying these and our users are continuously like asking us for more fan options on that work on, with uh, our uh, OnePlus eBay. battery platform. These, oh, wow. these However, fans, we understand so, that size yeah, and there's, storage there's drama are those huge obstacles <laughs> that our users face on a daily basis with traditional fans, which is exactly where the new OnePlus 4-inch It's too bad. Fan they've they've actually had play. ads for this, this these, fan is some of these tools for already. Yeah, these, these tools have already been site, advertised. So it's, golfing are even it's really hoping for some that we hadn't but with already integrated seen clamp design, stuff on. But. It can connect to different materials such as a 2x4, a ladder, a desk, a chair, or even a rounded pipe. With over 180 CFM, two speed settings, a rotating and pivoting head for directional airflow, this fan packs a punch in a very compact size. 
This fan is gonna keep you cool and comfortable everywhere you go. Up next, we have two new lights ready to take on any job. As you know, lighting so has have we seen a single HP tool yet? We've begun I don't think to any see of this these transition from your typical HP. halogen and incandescent lights to much more efficient LEDs. And as a result, we've begun to see brighter lights with reduced heat and extended run times. With the enhancements that LEDs provide, these next couple lights show our continuous commitment to our users for updating and innovating our current Ryobi OnePlus lighting solutions. Up first is our most compact Ryobi yeah. OnePlus light to date. I agree with that. Our brand let's, new let's Ryobi see a surprise tool OnePlus at the end. Give us, compact give us something, something really good with at the end. With 400 lumens of output, this light is ideal for taking on the campsite in those tight spaces, or if you ever find yourself without power, this light is gonna give you seven days of continuous runtime. Next in our lineup is our brand new Ryobi OnePlus LED light. This light is 75% brighter than its predecessor and has a lot more versatility as well. With 280 lumens of output, a 500 foot beam distance, this light is perfect for a variety of applications on the go. In addition, we went ahead and upgraded to was, a more was ergonomic the impact, uh, handle HP? design. Maybe, maybe the impact We then was added HP. a 130-degree pivoting head for handheld or hands-free directional days. lighting. That's a lot. All these tools that you saw here today are going to be offered exclusively at the Home Depot and HomeDepot.com, both as tool only and a variety of kit configurations. These tools are great additions to your job site, your campsite, or even your backyard. Back to you, Chip. There really has been no better time to get into the Ryobi OnePlus system with so many options for the homeowner, the DIYer, weekend warrior, and pro. Ryobi is really revamping things in their lighting category for a brighter job site and making sure you don't get caught in the dark during a power outage. We also have some other solutions coming up as well that would certainly have your back during a storm, keeping you connected where you need it and when you need it. Victoria, what do you got for us? Thanks, Chip. When it comes to power, Ryobi has you covered. Whether you're hunkering down for a storm or just need portable Solar power panel. on the go, Ryobi offers a <laughs> is, variety is that, is that, of power Is that a big solutions. enough uh, like, new From thing? From compact got solar power panel? sources all the way up to backup generators during a power outage. In this growing category, we have some new and exciting power solutions for the OnePlus customer to add to their collection. The Ryobi 18 volt OnePlus 150 watt power source is an extremely versatile tool. Similar to our current 18 volt power source, this will provide you with 150 watts of power to power most small electronics. It features one 120 volt So this is just an upgrade over the previous outlet, one. Two USB A ports. Yeah, and but now, does uh, solar panel work with your new USB generator port. that you got to charge the those 6-amp batteries? <laughs> I doubt it. <laughs> allows you to not only charge most small electronic devices, but it's also going to convert your power source into an 18-volt so charger This one does USB-C. Well, That's the one upgrade that that Allowing you to essentially charge your 18-volt batteries almost anywhere. Whether you're in your home or garage, traveling, in a remote location, or on a job site, this will provide you with power anywhere you need. Next up, we have the Ryobi 18 volt one plus 120 watt automotive inverter. This automotive inverter has dual power technology, meaning you can either use a 12 volt car port or an 18 volt one plus battery to charge your small electronic devices. Whether you're on a job site or need to charge your cell phone during a camping trip, this will give you the power you need when you need it the most. The low profile design will allow you to easily store this device in a small compartment like a glove box and then pull it out whenever you need it. The new Ryobi 14 watt and 21 watt solar panels allow you to charge any USB device as long as there's sunlight available. And the foldable compact design makes storage so easy. You can store it anywhere and then pull it out whenever you Wait, need it so most. It doesn't charge Both anything Both solar but panels USB stuff. include dual yeah. USB-A ports, meaning you can charge two devices at once, whether that be your iOS, Android, or other USB-A devices. And by pairing these solar panels with the 150 watt power source, you're able to use these to power your 18 volt OnePlus batteries. 
Oh, this oh, can charge there it was. up to two 18 volt one plus two amp hour batteries in one full day with full sunlight. With huh. these new panels, you can have power in the most remote location, keeping you as connected as you'd like. These there power solutions will be available exclusively at the Home Depot and HomeDepot.com in various kit configurations and tool only options. <laughs> the Ryobi 18 volt one plus tools are perfect tools for on the job site, in the home and oh, outside of the home. But in order to make a house thatcher? a home, what are they calling? the outside is just as important scrape up the grass? as the inside. And with these Dude, new 18 volt one plus man. tools, <laughs> we make that easier on you. Introducing the new 18 volt one plus is. HP brushless dethatcher aerator. The 18 volt one plus Wait, cultivator. Wait, aerator? What is it? The 18 Does it actually volt aerate? one plus patio sweeper. And the 18 volt one plus patio wire brush. The 18 volt one plus HP brushless dethatcher aerator is the perfect tool to remove HP. dead grass, keeping your lawn growing healthy. This high performance tool features a brushless motor which will provide you increased power and extended motor life. It also features collapsible handles for compact storage, two 18 volt one plus four amp hour batteries for extended runtime with two active battery ports, which will give you increased power. Not only that, so that but the lightweight key. design allows you to easily switch out the dethatcher reel for the aerator reel. And the four what point height adjustment do? allows so the key switches which battery is being used. Removal. So it only uses one battery Next at a time, but you can leave the batteries in and, and switch cultivator. the key. This is ideal for light gardening. But it does that. That does aeration. The durable steel tines. That's, that's on cool. my list. Can sure on my list. Inches wide and four inches deep. The three speed switch allows you to tackle a variety of soils and applications. Not only that. But cultivator. it comes with a adjustable handle and soft overmold grip for user comfort. We yeah, include it's too bad the Thatcher wasn't uh, 40 volt. Four amp I, think, hour I think that would be a lot better 40 volt to tool, but for sure. This works with any of your other 18 volt one plus batteries. Moving on to our 18 volt one plus patio sweeper. This is ideal for clearing away dirt and debris from sidewalks, driveways, patios, and more. The telescoping shaft allows you to easily adjust the height of the tool to whatever height you need. The soft overmold grip and the adjustable handle Chad's saying it uses both batteries at the same comfort. time. Are you sure, Chad? And it has a lightweight and intuitive design. I'm not this sure will about work that. with any of your 18 volt one plus batteries. Next up, let's cover could the be wrong. 18 we'll, we'll volt do some one plus patio wire brush. This is a new. I, I hope it uses both batteries because that means it's more. It's no closer to 40 volts. Like sold at the Home Depot but currently. We'll see. Its wire brush design is ideal for cleaning out dirt, debris, and weeds in between bricks, pavers, and other crevices on sidewalks, patios, and driveways. The adjustable handle and the soft <laughs> overmold grip are perfect for user comfort. The telescoping shaft and lightweight design make it so easy for the user to use. And like all of the other 18 volt one plus tools we've covered, this can work with your other 18 volt one plus batteries. All of these 18 volt one plus tools that we've covered are sold exclusively at the Home Depot. So that's that's another one. The, the brush is, is very Ryobi to, to have and tool only a, a very specific tool. Next up, that let's cover I'm our use one. I was gonna say, who HP uses a brush? Easy clean so something, I mean, it's at for somebody. 600 but, PSI, yeah. this is perfect. Holy cow, 600 PSI. They've, they've upped the other one's 320. The adjustable pressure wow, button allows 100. you to dial back PSI where you may not need all of that pressure, or you could use it on high to blast away stubborn dirt and debris. Connect any standard garden hose or the 20 foot siphon hose in order to pull water from any fresh water source. This also comes with a two liter bottle adapter and the nozzle features a three in one spray pattern, 15 degree turbo and rinse to tackle a variety of applications. This 18 volt one plus easy clean power cleaner is compatible with all of the current easy clean accessories 
as well as yeah, our really new and upcoming these easy clean. Easy There's clean tons of little accessories and We're nozzles rolling out and a ton yeah, of new easy clean sprayers and all kinds of such stuff. Such as the multi-purpose brush, the extension pole, two extension And that looks good for dirt bikes. Connect kit, a two meter a adapter that we could uh, you, a hose, <laughs> you could clean them anywhere, I guess. Get so on the top of your roof and clean your windows. The I don't know. That's actually not a one plus bad idea. HP brushless power cleaner and all of its easy clean accessories will be sold exclusively at the Home Depot and homedepot.com. Now let's pass it back to you, Chip. Once again, Ryobi is disrupting the industry with a massive number of tools offered on their OnePlus platform. And among all the new tools they showed today, uh, this last Ryobi minute. will continue to improve upon those lines Are and they accessory give us offerings. Are we gonna As get you the can last see minute. Here, Ryobi will also be revamping their drilling and driving accessories and offering completely refreshed assortments of their impact rated drive bits for three times longer life, giving you the perfect project starter sets. Be on the lookout for the new jigsaw blades, oscillating multi-tool blades, as well as circular saw blades. Make sure to sign up for Ryobi's mailing list so you're up to date on all the latest tool offerings. Now, don't miss our next event coming in early fall, where we'll have some really big launches as well, especially in those expansion categories. Thanks so much for joining us, and we'll see you next time. Ah, uh, okay. Well. have a bonus tool at the end there but uh so uh a couple hp tools we saw a couple hp tools um no 40 volts um and a lot of these we'd seen before like a lot of these we've, we've had advertisements for so uh, not 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 what we were hoping for but uh you know still good what do you think sam I forgot that I'm actually want to get some of the lights <laughs> that they have just to have them around. But yeah, the, the, it, the power source. I'm I'm excited for the solar panel. The power like the source charge. was my next one. That was going to be that'll be an interesting. I have yet to find a power like a power source that uses battery technology and a solar panel very effectively. It's yeah. kind of like there's not really they're not really made for each other or they're really really expensive one or the other. Yeah, yeah, I, I like that. I mean, initially when they said they could only do USB charging, could only charge yeah. USB devices, I was like, no, no, count me out. Um, but yeah, the fact that it can do batteries, I'm I'm, I'm on board with that. Yeah, especially uh, if you already have an assortment of batteries. But I'm guessing you're gonna have to uh, buy their new uh, what's it called. Uh, their adapter their adapter thing instead of using the old ones yeah so that'll be interesting um yeah the uh dethatcher aerator that looks interesting it looked i would have expected it a lot more bulky you know yeah the aerator aerators are usually like, a lot bigger yeah it looks it looked very like like their lawnmowers are beefier than, than that was so uh, we'll, we'll see if that works. That that one's like the most interesting because it was an HP tool and it does the dethatching and the aeration. So um, that'd be cool, but kind of kind of weird. <laughs> really, uh, yeah. Like I, I see a lot of uh, face palm. <laughs> no coffee maker. Yeah, seriously. Why no coffee you... maker. No. Uh, all this yeah. wanted a framer, but I mean, the I framing could... nailer. That was the big one. Yeah. Where's the framing nailer? That's like this. This piece... was their chance. Especially when they're slimming down their other nailers the, to be lighter and more compact, which I actually think is a good idea. Um, the, the, now, I will say the automotive seemed like probably the best, and they led with that, was their automotive tools. Um, I don't know if you caught that, Sam, is they, they brought out their big impact. Um, so they got their full size. It's 100 or uh, what was it, 1,100 um, wow foot pounds of torque or something like it's it's a beast it's it's finally they've That's got a their wrist breaker uh, yeah <laughs> yeah so they finally got some of the big ones um but yeah i think i think their automotive was kind of the highlight and that's what they led with so you know it, it did so this video for for anyone that's watching um yeah they they brought out uh we'll kind of recap real quick they had the automotive they had their um kind of their home improvement like their 
their saws and stuff was the the second part that they talked about. Um, they talked about some of their home stuff. Their uh, they had like their glue gun and some of those things. Um, they had their fans. Uh, again, all of this stuff we kind of knew about. Uh, some of them were already announced. Some of them, um, you know, had been alluded to. Uh, their lights, they, they got a couple improvement on lights, not a single vacuum. That was like my one thing. Like I just wanted like a, a new vacuum. Yeah. Uh, I feel like they need to take a step up in their vacuums. They're okay. I don't think they're fantastic. I think they could get a little bit better. Yeah. Yeah. And so, yes, someone asked if they do have a, they do have a snowblower. Ryobi does have a snowblower. Uh, they do. Yep. Yeah. They, they have uh, both the, um, like a snow shovel. I guess they call it like it's it's like a that's yeah, a little snow like, shovel, like a shovel and it just kind of chucks it ahead of you a little bit, which would never work in Utah. Never, um, at least not in the areas that, that we're at. Um, but uh, yeah, and then the uh, the actual snow blower, um, and we had the we had the original, well, one of the original ones. Um, they've come out with a much much better one. So. Yeah, um, power inverters. Yeah, that was what I was. Thinking. Yeah, and rug guy asked, the storage would be nice. I think that would be cool. I would love Ryobi to come out with a whole storage solution as well. Just well, and they have they have like small compartment things. Yeah, like little but like a little whole tool storage. But, but yeah, give me give me a whole a whole setup. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Especially like a modular setup. Like they could they could do a modular setup where it has like compartments that are if just put all your tools just right in there to plug and play kind of like you know because you recently we did a video logan did a video on the new chainsaw we had and that case actually was a well thought out case where you can put stuff put the oil put the batteries and it'd be like i would love them to expand on that solution yeah no for for sure um what yeah. else did we stand out in that I think the aerator is cool because I'm the guy that never aerates as long because I don't want to pay someone else to do it. But yeah. having the your own tool, maybe I would do it. Yeah. So, oh, that, that was the, what I was going to say is it looks like their video's live now. Or, in fact, it was pre-recorded. So they, I think they learned from last time because last time they did a live or it was I, – I don't know if that one was pre-recorded too, but it seemed like it was like they were trying to do it live. And it was really choppy and it wasn't a great release. So this one they did release as a pre-recorded live video. You can go watch it. I, I'm sure it's, yeah, it's already on their, the Ryobi Tools USA channel. So you can go check that out. If you missed anything that we've, we've talked about, again, we'll, we'll do a, a, a deep dive video um, of what they released and uh, try and put that out uh, tomorrow. But uh, unfortunately, I, f I feel... A little let down. I feel unsatisfied. Yeah. <laughs> I want at least. Well, that. after let's be let's be fair though. After their last launch, like they came out with some pretty rad stuff. I feel like their last launch was a really big step up for them for the tools that they came out. So that's true. That's, I, that's maybe fair. maybe we were expecting the same thing. Kind of like every time, give us yeah. a billion new. <laughs> step it up. Tools, step it up. Step it up. You know. So so this this uh, this felt. Like filler tools. Um, no offense to the tools, I guess. Yeah, um, like that, or filler tools or just stuff that's not, you know, people people are interested in, but not. I, I think the hardcore home improvement guys are kind of like, yeah. Yeah, and and don't get me wrong. There's like I, like we already pointed out. There's some good ones in there, um, and we'll we'll talk about them in our uh, video tomorrow. But. Um, by and large, there's 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 a lot of a lot of incremental upgrades, like the the pressure washer, like that uh, 600 psi. That's actually washer. pretty cool. That's actually a lot of pressure for a handheld, you know, pressure washer. That's pretty impressive. So, okay, well, um, yeah. Any any other comments? What about well, a yeah, I uh, I think Filtran is like giving his crap, basically saying that we're supposed to use the Ryobi tools to build a storage solution. <laughs> That's Logan. I'm too lazy. I was like, I'll just, I'll just buy it from Logan. He'll come, I'll pay him to do it. Buy it, yeah. <laughs> we'll build it. Well, um, cool guys. Thanks. Uh, thanks for joining. Thanks for, uh, thanks for watching. Um, 
this was fun. We haven't, uh, it's been, it's been what, two, almost, I think, I think I saw it was like two years, three years ago almost that we've, we've done a live on, on this channel. So, uh, definitely, uh, uh, should do this more often. Um, and if, Hey, if Ryobi keeps doing these videos, they keep releasing tools. We, we'll, we'll keep, uh, trying to do these lives. So awesome. Thanks for watching guys. Uh, appreciate, uh, Appreciate you sticking with us through uh, through some of our technical difficulties. Speaking being one of those, um, but uh, yeah, um, I think I think that's all I got. Anything else, Sam? No, guys. Thanks for watching, and uh, we got some exciting stuff coming on the channel too. Some new stuff that we've gotten for Ryobi. So stay tuned for that. Yeah, there's a backlog of tools that we want to get to because they, they like you said the last one they released all those hp tools so yeah more more videos coming let us know uh what you guys want to see in the comments after this video uh ends so okay guys have a good one see you in the next